Well, this is the setting for our featured match today. Welcome to you. Plenty of harmony on the gantry, I can assure you, between Alan Smith and myself, Martin Tyler. We've got a curtain raiser to the new season for you. It's Bayern Munich against Borussia Dortmund. Yeah, final chance for two managers to try out one or two things before the serious stuff starts, but they'll also be hoping these players are pretty close to being fully fit. Paco Alcacer. That is a supreme save at full stretch. Corner from Guerrero. Dortmund. Well, talk about getting the reward, the hard draft. They've been at it from the start. The goal then for Borussia Dortmund. Well, it was a beautifully struck corner and the finish was deadly. And that's a goal well worth analysing again. Shreds it through. Oh man. Well, this could bring them level. And it does! Important point in the game. Oh, what a game changer that might be. I think the momentum's just shifted. Oh, a bit of quality show there. An accurate side foot. Keep it no chance. Well, let's take another look at the goal. Be surprised if this manager made a substitution now. His team aren't at it, and now it's all square. Bayern well in control of the possession stakes, but they have been a bit disappointing so far in the way that they've gone about the business. I don't know if they've taken it a little bit easy. They were expecting to win this, I was expecting them to. Still got a good chance of doing that, but they've got to be better than so far. The old fans can't believe it, can they? Fully expected the ref to point to the spot there. Lewandowski. Thiago. Alisso. He's got it away. Well, not surprisingly, the fans pretty angry with that decision. They were sure that was a penalty. Set up to play on the break now. Take the lead here. It's a wonderful display by the goalkeeper today. And he's kept the team in the match. The score's still level. Well, that should give his teammates a lot of heart that maybe they can go on and win this. The pressure all on the penalty takers now because we're going to decide this game via the penalty shooter. Ready to go. Beat the goalkeeper well in this penalty shootout. So next up to take the penalty. Shaw from the spot in the shootout. All you need to do is put it in the net in the shootout and he's done it. It's time to step up. Well, he's up to the task with his penalty. A save by the goalkeeper. 
Ready to go, the next penalty taker. No nerves from him in this shootout. Oh, he missed! Nobody likes to see a player miss under those circumstances. Here's the chance to be a real hero, to score the penalty and win the game for your side. Well, the pressure really on, isn't it? He has to score, otherwise they lose. Well, good chance and he's missed the target. Well, he scored in the shootout. Well, he knows now, one successful shot, and they've won it. Put the penalty away, and very confident he was. That's the outcome that they wanted, certainly the penalty taker. Never any doubt for me. Very assured walking up to that. Well, that's brought it to conclusion, this big, big final here. But sadly, the conclusion is not a happy one for the team that... Alan, we thought we were good enough to win today. We did, and you have to feel for those players because they didn't have the run of the ball when it mattered. One or two decisions went against, and in the end, those factors were the telling moments. And you've said often before, Alan, you, you can't take for granted you'll ever win anything again, so when you do get a winner's medal, as they're getting here and celebrating, just drink it in, milk the moment. It's easy to think that the good times will keep on evolving, but it's not always the case. I think these players appreciate that. It's been a brilliant occasion. All credit to the organisers for the way it's staged. It sets it up. It makes it such a theatre for these football performers to go on. And this team didn't fluff their lines, did they? They certainly didn't, and that's so satisfying.